please make your way up, pick one plate up from each of them, and more importantly, enjoy. Thank you. Who's hungry? Yeah. yeah? Don't worry, yellow's always the best. Just remember, yellow, yellow. And those of you who speak Spanish, amarillo. So I'll smile, I'll dance, I'll laugh, I'll do whatever I gotta do to make sure that I stay memorable in their minds when they're sitting down filling out those little cards. They gotta fall in love with you, and then they fall in love with your food. Who cooks the best? Mama, right? Yeah. Yes, who's a mama? Right here. Oh, the mom card again. Wow. Hi. What is this? It's a, a fried chicken lollipop. Yes. Yes. yes, I'm excited to try it. Thank you. Don't listen to that mom down there. It's just a little bit of my childhood in there. I really wish they would have given me some purple plates for obvious reasons, but I guess the pink ones don't work. So it's uh, my version of uh, a mini fish and chips. It's Cobb Brandad rolled in a crispy Katavi pastry. It's a great buy for me after a night out, and uh, as regards comfort food, it's the only way to go. I've been working on this for a while. Well, you're lucky, I love watermelon. It's really good, too. Okay. Here, please, by all means. Thank you. Of course. In general, people say that I'm a flirt. I disagree. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm living the dream one day at a time. How was the party? Thank you. <laughs> I'm Rio. I'm great, how are you? Good, thank you. Look at that little leaf, isn't that cute? It's delicious. Why, thank you. <laughs> Please enjoy. Thank you so much. I don't get it. <laughs> I'm excited I know. for this. It smells amazing. Wow. I don't really like salmon, but I like this. Dope. Really good? Okay, guys, start filling out the cards, please. Can't wait to hear your feedback. Now that the hungry club goers have tasted all four dishes, they will judge each one, ranking their favorites from first to last. I would have to go yeah. probably Cody first. I say Cody as well. The chef that totals the most first place votes will win the challenge. That was tough. Dali, what was your favorite? I love Corey's. I love ginger, and it really hit off like the top of the tongue. And after like drinking and dancing, yes. that's definitely what I'd do again too. Sure. Young lady, what was your favorite? Cody. It was perfectly cooked, and I just thought the pairing of chicken and watermelon was yeah. phenomenal. Quite refreshing as well. Wasn't it, it was a great palate cleanser. Oh my god, it's so good. They seem to be enjoying the food. That's for sure. I could fail this challenge super hard, but I just feel like I did my grandma so proud. Win or lose, I I feel proud. It's all that matters, right? I'm I'm happy with me. Yeah. My grandma would have really liked that dish. The results are in. Let's go in reverse order, shall we? The chef, whose dish was light the least, with only 15% of the votes, is Mary Lou. <laughs> Aww. It's OK. In third place, with 23% of the votes, is Declan. It's now between Cody and Corey. The winner of this incredible challenge, congratulations, goes to Corey. Well done. <laughs> wow. I'm the winner. Well done. I'm so excited. I'm stepping up my game and I'm showing what I can do. This is big for me. This is real big. This incredible reward is spectacular. In fact, the reward is so spectacular, you shouldn't experience it alone. So, who would you like to take with you today? Oh, shit. Definitely want to reward Mary Lou for picking me last time, but you know what? I have to go with the runner up. Um, thank you, Cody. Me? I'm not expecting this at all right now. Today's reward is a shopping spree at Macy's. What the fuck? You'll get to spend a total of $4,000. $2,000 each. I don't think I've ever had two grand to spend on myself on whatever I want. Once you get inside Macy's, there's a special second big prize waiting for you there as well. Go. Would I want a shopping spree? Yeah. But Corey doesn't do anything accidentally. 